So for the students that are selected to be here, uh, they're selected because of what they do on the field and off the field. Right? Life isn't just about athleticism, it's not just about scholarly, scholarly achievement. There's a goal inside, right? After the sports end, but that honor, that courage, commitment go on into to life skills. And uh, that's really what this is all about. Simplified Ellis. A term the Marines hold very dear um, to mantra. We hear it, us yelling it to each other, exchanging greetings. Um, it really echoes you know, something we hold dear. It directly translated means always faithful. Faithful to our core, to our country, and uh, to the other things that we need. Again, as I mentioned before, these, these students are selected for, for their leadership on their teams and in their schools and in their own communities. It's something they've already demonstrated, and it's something they've demonstrated during this bowl week. Um, we support a community service event with the community of Carson. We were able to mingle with the teams, learn some athletic skills and also mingle with Marines to, to further enhance you know, that integrity, that giving back. After all, we've been given, all these students have been given, already starting to reach back. Integrity, always, always looking forward, never lie, cheat, steal. It's the, that whole person concept, right? full development. Moving forward, we hope that they obviously see the Marine Corps always in a positive light, and understand that, that we are here um, really helping helping them be able to do what they want to do. Obviously, some of these young men want to become Marines in the future. That would be awesome. You know, they surely demonstrate the values that we're looking for in our future leaders and future Marines. But ultimately, what we want them to take is um, to be good citizens, to be better than they were today or tomorrow. That's where we all can really act.